I don't think there was a female court justice when Gerald Ford was around. And I don't think there was one when Jimmy Carter was around. She's been there for a minute. Hmm. I'm inclined to say Ronald Reagan. Uh, and so I think I should say C, Ronald Reagan. Final answer? Final answer. Ronald Reagan. All right, you got the 32,000, okay. Still got the three lifelines. We're looking at $64,000. That's yeah. good. That's You're great. You're five so far. away from a million. That's great. Everything right. is, is gravy now. Okay, now it's getting serious, though. This, this is, is serious good. money. So here it is for $64,000. Rachel McLish, Linda Murray, and Corey Iverson have all held what title? Miss USA, Miss Olympia. Congresswoman, Teacher of the Year. Congresswoman doesn't sound familiar. And I'm kind of thinking it's going to be either Miss USA or Miss Olympia. I think it's B. I think it's B, Miss Olympia. Want to make it your final answer? Yeah, I'm going to make that my final answer. Wait. Ah, uh, you okay. said it, but Go it ahead. doesn't matter. You're right for $64,000. <laughs> Just won $64,000, going for $125,000. Now listen, <sighs> Queen... Yeah! Yeah. No, the kids can really use it. This is, this is great. You're four away from a million, and you've four got three lifelines, okay? okay. Oh, yeah. So sure. you ready? Let's do it. For $125,000, okay. okay. here's the question. Okay. Which of these plays was not written by Tennessee Williams? The Glass Menagerie, The Subject Was Roses, The Night of the Iguana, The Rose Tattoo. audience has been doing pretty good so far. Yeah, they've been good. Let me ask the audience. I'm going to use a lifeline right. to ask the audience. Let's do it. Let's go to the audience. Queen Latifah needs your help. On your keypads, using A, B, C, or D, please vote now. Wow. 82% say it's the subject was roses. That's extremely unanimous, so I'm going to go with B. The subject was roses. Final? Final answer. It's a good one for $125,000. When we come back, she's going for a quarter million dollars. All right, Queen Latifah. All right. Little nervous there, huh? You know she... $125,000 so far for the La uh, Lancelot H. Owen Scholarship Foundation that's in honor of her <laughs> late brother, I'm founded so by your mother. Yes. And been eight years now. Yeah. How many kids do you think you've helped to get into college? Oh, we've helped at least 30 kids. No at kidding. least 30 kids. And the thing about it is they all have to come back and mentor in the community. So they can't just go to school. They got to get back. That's good. That's great. And I hear you are, Queen. Three away from $1 million. Three you away got from two lifelines okay. left. We're looking at a quarter million dollars here. But should you miss, you'll lose 93000 So here it comes for $250,000. let us play. In 1999, the RIAA created what award to recognize albums that have sold more than 10 million copies? Diamond, platinum, titanium, emerald. <laughs> this guy over here sold that many records. I'm like, um, gosh, I'm nervous, but... Um... A, diamond. Final answer. That's my final answer. 
Got it for yeah. 250 votes. Boy, what does that mean to uh, the uh, Lancelot have Owens no Foundation? no idea. Oh, boy. But that means a lot. All right, now, Queen Latifah, you're two questions away from the million, and you've got two lifelines left, so we're in terrific shape here. Let's take a look at this one now for a half million dollars. In his poem, Valediction, Forbidding Mourning, to what does John Donne compare himself and his lover? Bow and arrow sides of a house, spokes in a wheel, legs of a compass. <clears throat> legs of a compass is, is real sexy. <laughs> that's, that's cute. That's working together. <laughs> um, you know what? I think I'm going to use a lifeline on this one. Want to call somebody? Narrow it down? I'm going to call Joe Trella, who just won a million bucks on this show a few weeks ago. Well, how do you know Joe? I got friends, you know, in high places, and uh, so a... I called Joe, you know? You call know? Joey. Joey. Get Joey on the phone. That's a great idea. All I'm right. going to call AT Joe Trella. AT&T. Let's get Joe Trella, That's our right. third millionaire from the show, on the line. Please be there, Joe. Hello? Hello, Joe. Hey, we just long time no see. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, we're here with Queen Latifah, and she has you as your phone a friend, as you know. She's uh, kind of hung up on a question here that's worth a half million dollars. Ooh, you okay. remember those kinds of questions. Okay, oh, yeah. she's going to read you the, uh, the question and the four answers, and let's see if you come up and can help her, okay? I'll try. Okay, Queen Latifah, 30 seconds, start now. In his poem, A Valediction, Forbidding Morning, to what does John Dunn compare himself and his lover? Bow and arrow? Spokes in a wheel, sides of a house, legs of a compass. Ooh, oh man. Um, you know, I, I'm. Ten seconds. Okay, I'm not sure. Um, I'm really not sure. I apologize. Um, just something I didn't cover. I'm sorry. <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Okay. Well, look, you can walk away, you can narrow it down, you can go for the 500000 Could you miss? You could lose 218000 Well, I, I could at least use the 50-50 lifeline. Why don't we do it? Okay? Computer, take away two of the wrong answers, please, leaving one wrong answer and the correct one. Well, there it is, spokes in a wheel and those legs of a compass that you were talking about earlier. <laughs> this is hard. Spokes in a wheel. Legs of a compass. I will gracefully bow out. Take the twenty. All right. All righty. Tell you what. Let's just. Um, let's just find out what the real answer is, and let's let you guess first. Legs or spokes? I think legs is real sexy. You know, you think of the, I mean, but, you know, probably spokes in a wheel. That's See? your final, final guess? <laughs> yeah, I got my money now, so sure. <laughs> no, it was the legs. legs. Of a yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you said oh. that about 10 minutes ago. I should have went with my gut, but I didn't know, so I'll take the money. I'm happy. Here Thank you are, so baby. Much, <laughs> Good luck to you. Hey, the Avril, the and there they are. Thank you so much. Yes. Oh my God. The kids are gonna love this. It's all for the kids. Go to college, baby, right here. Two hundred fifty thousand. Another wonderful moment for another wonderful person. Really inspiring to see how much these people care about their charities and the people they're helping. So We've got our two final celebrities. How about we have a dance-off?